about 11 o'clock today, we're going to start looking at who's got how many spits dug, what sort of fines are coming up, all that sort of thing. Uh, we expect you all to be roughly at about the same level, hopefully. Don't forget uh, to fill in the paperwork. We will obviously be checking it when we come round, just to make sure that you have. The recording is absolutely vital. Again, as I said last night, if you don't record it properly, we'll just throw it all in the bin because it's of no use to anybody. And we're going to get a bit competitive, and the team that has dug the least bits will be shot and thrown in the river. Okay? <laughs> so bearing that in mind, get out and get stuck in. But most of all, enjoy yourselves. We put it here because we're on the north side of the church, the cloisters that we were talking about yesterday should be somewhere in this area. So this wall roughly follows the line of the cloisters. So you're talking about a, a, one of the cloistral ranges here and it's going to be a big range of buildings. So we, it doesn't matter whether we're a metre from the wall or five metres, we're going to be in the building if it's here. To get the soil off, use a mattock. Now don't use it like a pickaxe, don't dig. What you can do is get the blade almost flat like that, yeah? And then just do that. And you can take off quite a lot of soil, quite delicately. So if you want to have a try with that, rather than <laughs> messing about with the trails. That's, yeah, I mean, get right over it. Get the blade as flat as you can yeah. towards the earth, yeah? yeah? yeah. That's it, that's it. And you're just trimming it gently then. Don't go too deep. And what you need to do is write on, on this white bit, in a uh, permanent marker, the site code, the trench number, and what context yeah. you're in. Technically speaking, in archaeology, a context is an archaeological feature. All we're doing is taking off soil horizons in 10 centimetre layers, so it is technically a spit, but, I mean, again, as archaeologists, we're so used to calling everything context that we've called it context, so context it is, but uh, it's, for the purposes of what we're doing, it's okay. I mean, we can call it banana for all the difference it makes. It's just basically a 10 centimetre layer in numerical order. Oh yeah! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fantastic! That's medieval, amazing. medieval floor tile. See that? I think it's a flower, isn't it? They've yeah. they've stamped it when the clay's been wet, and then it, it's obviously it's very battered. But they've filled that with white slip. And I was just chatting to one of the locals, and apparently the church has got a load of tiles a bit like this in there. So it might be worth having a look in the church in a bit and see if we can match this up. Definitely, we'll but, have to. That's fantastic. And how far down was it? Uh, they're about forty centimeters down now. So it's it's still getting Victorian pottery out, but. This is mixed in with it as well. That's amazing. Um, I mean, that's the sort of thing you'd expect to find from our status building as well. We shouldn't get too excited, but I am. That's brilliant, <laughs> isn't it?